So Team STJ got a brand new NBA 2K15 discussion video for you guys. In this video, we're going to be talking about defense. You know, I got to play this game early like you guys already know. And I really haven't touched upon defense in this game. And I'm telling you, 2K15 really emphasizes defense and it really does emphasize skill with defense. In previous 2K titles such as 2K14, it was very easy to do that, to do that zigzag cheese, right? You move side to side, the guy eventually jumps and then you get a 3. Easy. That's all you got to do. Especially if they're man to man. All you got to do is hope they're playing user defense. You go zigzag right to the left, right to the left. Especially if you're Michael Jordan, they obviously can't keep up with you. And then bam, you cross them over, post rising dunk over everybody's face. Doesn't matter if they're post riser or not. That happens. We all saw that. It was very frustrating, right? Let's be real, that was really frustrating. It was just part of my team. This is something if they did to us, we did to them. It was just part of the game. But this is no longer going to be happening on a very, very consistent basis because now defense in this game is insane. We're going to be talking about the skill aspect too. But before we do that, let me just tell you guys some major changes they did make with defense in terms of settings. This year, defensive settings are back amazing news for everybody I mean they're breaking it all back you can now stop everything you you know you don't like about another player for every single individual player you can force screens you can do double teams you can match up by matchup you could do player by play you can do so many things hedge all that stuff we remember from previous 2k titles it's back in this game you could do whatever you got to do to this player and you can really customize your defense toward that specific player so that's obviously a really good thing that they did in this game but also the defense in this game is insane because now the zigzag cheese is gone so you can literally stick with them you actually stick with them when they have the ball and that was so frustrating for me when I had D Rose because QJB had good defense man I couldn't do anything skill matters if you know how to play defense if you know how to time time everything in terms of when they're gonna move to the right when they're gonna move to the left they will actually stick with the player they will actually stick with them they're not gonna lose them this game has real defense but of course if you can come out with some crazy crossover moves maybe get a nice pick and roll going you can create some space or especially have a fast break but honestly if you have good defense now this really does the matter in skill now if you have good defense good predictability you will definitely outplay your defender in terms of defense and that's what made this game so insane for me when I realized if I'm a better defender than you it's gonna be hard for you to score you ain't gonna cheese the score we already made a video how cheese is gone in this game you go ahead and check that out and we talked a little bit about this but yes skill matters in this game if you guys don't how to play defense and read the player's offense oh you're gonna love this game hope you guys enjoyed 2k15 so close let me know what you guys think thumbs up subscribe we're gonna be going ham pitch